Can you understand and steal me on the case for the drug trade on Silk Road? Like making, can you make the case that it's a net positive for society? So there was a time period of when we found out the infrastructure and when we built the case against Ross. I don't remember exactly, six weeks, a month, two months, I don't know, somewhere in there. Um, but then at Ross's sentencing, there was a father that stood up and talked about his son dying. And I went back and kind of did the math and it was between those time periods of when we knew we could shut it down, we could have pulled the plug on the server and gone. And when Ross was arrested, uh, his son died from buying drugs on Cell Ground. And I still think about that father a lot. But if we look at the scale at the war on drugs, let's just even outside of Silk Road, do you think the war on drugs by the United States has caused, has alleviated more suffering or caused more suffering in the world? That might be above my pay scale. I mean, I understand the other side of the argument. I mean, people said that I don't have to go down to the corner to buy drugs. I'm not gonna get shot on the corner buying drugs or something. I can just have them sent to my house. People are gonna do drugs anyways. I understand that argument. Um, from my personal standpoint, if I made it more difficult for my children to get drugs, then I'm satisfied. So your personal philosophy is that if we legalize all drugs, including heroin and cocaine, that that would not make for a better world. I don't, no, personally, I don't believe Do legalizing all drugs would make, make for a better world. Can you imagine that it would? Do you understand that argument? Sure, yeah, I mean, as I've gotten older, I've started to, I like to see both sides of an argument. And when I can't see the other side, I, that's when I like, really like to dive into it. And I can see the other side. I can see the why people would say that. Um, but I don't want to be, a, my group raise children in a world where where drugs are just free for, for use. Well, and then the other side of it is with Silk Road. Did, uh, you know, taking down Silk Road, did that increase or decrease the number of uh, dr drug trading criminals in the world? It's unclear. Online, I think it increased. I think, uh, you know, that, that's one of the things I think about a lot with Silk Road was that no one really knew. I mean, there, there was, uh, you know, thousands of users. But then after that, it was on the front page of the paper and there was millions of people that knew about Tor and, and Onion sites. We, it was an advertisement. Um, you know, I would have thought, I thought crypto was gonna crash right after that. Like, I don't know, what people now see that bad, bad people are doing bad things with crypto. That'll crash, well, I'm obviously wrong on that one. Uh, and I thought, you know, Ross was sentenced to two life sentences plus 40 years. No one's gonna start up these, dark markets exploded after that. Yeah. Um, you know, the, some of them started as, you know, opportunistic. I'm going to, you know, take those escrow accounts and I'm going to steal all the mo all the money that came in. You know, there were for that. But, you know, but there were a lot of dark markets that popped up after that. Now we we put the playbook out there. Yeah. Yeah. But, and also there's a case for, uh, do you ever think about not taking down, if you've not taken down Silk Road, you could use it because it's a market it itself is not necessarily the primary criminal organization. It's a market for criminals. So it could be used to track down criminals in the physical world. So if you don't take it down, and given that it was, you know, the central, how centralized it was, it could be used as a place to find criminals, right? As so opposed the, the to- the dealers, the drug dealers, take it down the, the drug dealers. dealers? Yeah. So if you have the card, get the cartels, start get to involved, you, you go after the dealers. It would have been very difficult. Because of Tor and all Because that. of all the protections, the anonymity. Decloaking all that would have been drastically more difficult. And a lot of people in upper management of the FBI didn't have the appetite of running something like that. That would have been the FBI running a drug market. How many, how many kids, how many fathers would have to come in and said, my kid bought while the FBI was running a site, a drug site, my kid died. So I didn't know anybody in the FBI in management that would have the appetite to let us run what was happening on Silk Road. Um, you know, because remember at that time, we still believe in six people are dead. We're still investigating, you know, where are all these bodies? Um, you know, that's pretty much why we took down Ross when we did. I mean, we, we had to jump on it fast.